so lonely when you leave me I need someone where go home me mm -hmm. I need love, I need totally I need love, I need somebody, I need love mm -hmm. I need somebody, I need touch mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. I need Bye. totally What's up, Cancer, and welcome to my channel. I hope all of my beautiful and my handsome Cancers out there are doing well. All right, you guys, we're going to pull up some cards, and we're going to see whatever it is. Let's see what it is that Spirit wants you to know. If anything resonates, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment. And if you're interested in a personal or anything else that you want to know about me, it will be in the description box below. All right, Cancer, let's go. Messages for my cancer, call the spirit. <clears throat> what is it that my beautiful and my handsome cancers need to know? Okay, so we have sadness. Someone here could be experiencing some type of sadness. There can be like gloom over someone's life right now. This could be because someone is experiencing sorrow. Maybe there has been some type of loss or someone feels like a failure here. Or they've been experiencing a lot of delays, okay? So someone here, all these delays that they've been experiencing kind of has their life feeling a little bit gloomy. Like they're not sure of the outcome, what's going to happen. You know, some type of news someone could receive could cause some type of sadness here. I feel like there's also someone that is sad, possibly over some type of betrayal or deception here now this could be someone that has neglected their social life okay maybe there's why there's this gloom or this cloud this kind of hanging over someone's life you know maybe they haven't been able to socialize or you know be around family and friends and you know just enjoy themselves the way that they excuse me they want to i feel like also there's a lot of gossip and some scandal, you know what I'm saying, that's going around as well with this Three of Cups. I feel like justice is about to be served. I feel like there's about to be a fair outcome. I feel like something has caused something, and it's like you have to live like the cause and effects or like deal with some type of consequences here or take some type of accountability. So I feel like someone here in a relationship, in a marriage, in a situation, they feel like a failure. But I feel like there's a lot of sadness, too, around this situation, okay? Because I feel like someone here, like, you know, their life or things, like, they're not happy. It's the energy that I'm picking up. I'm picking up the overall energy, like, someone here is not happy. There's a lot of gloom, a lot of cloudy days. I feel like someone here feels like a failure or there's a lot of delays. I also feel there is the energy, because cancer, this is your energy. Maybe you feel betrayed. Maybe you feel like you haven't really had a social life. But I feel like there's also some, some type of gossip that's going around about some type of scandal here. But I feel like you will receive some type of fair outcome, okay? Just as you can be dealing with the legal system here. But I feel like you will receive some type of fair outcome when it comes to a situation. But I feel like you have to take accountability for, you know, your part or what you did or the role that you play here or taking accountability will allow you to have some type of fair outcome here. Tell us more, Holy Spirit, about the sun. Messages for my cancers. Tell us about the sun. Some of you could be dealing with the Leo. We got cancer and we also have Libra here, okay? Tell us about the sun, Holy Spirit. Okay, but I feel like there's about to be a sudden change, okay? So I feel like, yeah, this is the energy that you've been feeling, Karen. So I feel like you've been the one that's been feeling this sorrow, this sadness, kind of like this gloom, you know, like these cloudy days. Like there's just been a cloud over you. You haven't been able to like shake this funk. Thank you, Spirit. I feel like you've kind of been in this funk and you haven't been able to shake it. But Spirit wants to let you know there's about to be a change here. You're not going to always be in this energy. Now, this change could come with some type of painful loss or some type of tragedy here. Tell us about this tower, Holy Spirit. You can have Scorpio placements in your chart, Cancer. You can be dealing with the Scorpio. Tell us about this tower, Holy Spirit. This has to do with some type of action.
So I feel like this change that's going to come, I feel like you're going to have to be fearless when it comes to this change here, okay? I feel like you also were dealing with someone who was not considerate of your feelings here, okay? So I feel like I'm picking up two different energies. I'm picking up your energy and there's also someone else's energy that I'm picking up as well. And I feel like whoever this was, they were very reckless. With you, they were very careless. This is someone who didn't care about you, your feelings. And I feel like there's about to be a change in this person's life. That this is someone who's going to experience some type of painful loss, some type of trauma. There's a lot of chaos around this person's life. Tell us about this betrayal, Holy Spirit. Three of Cups. Messages for my cancers, Holy Spirit. Tell us about this betrayal. I love you guys. And if anything is resonating for you, Karen, so don't forget to like this video. Tell us about this betrayal, Holy Spirit. Or what is this gossip? What is this scandal? Messages for my cancer. Tell us about the three of cups. Okay, we got the ten of wands here. So I feel like... Do you feel like this? Oh, what is this? Okay, so I feel like for some of you guys, maybe that you neglected your social life. Maybe you feel like you had a lot of responsibilities or you had a lot of duties or a lot of burdens that kept you from enjoying life. From I feel like this is the energy that's been keeping you sad. It's because of these responsibilities, these duties. You know, you feel in burden, feel like you got to do this, you got to do that. It's because you've been putting in a lot of hard work. But I feel like it's hard for you to concentrate. It's hard for you to focus on your goals here, okay? So this is this somebody here put, projecting this energy onto you? Tell us about the three of cups, Holy Spirit. Messages for my cancers. I feel like for some of you, you could have made some type of poor financial investments or you you know, could have spent your money or, or you were giving generously to other people, maybe helping other people or giving to other people. And this could have caused some type of lack or maybe it could have caused you maybe not to be in the, the area or the place that you want to be financially here. I feel like for some of you guys, you could have gave to someone as well. And this could have been someone who betrayed you or they deceived you. Maybe this person lied about the reason why, you know what I'm saying, they needed this money or whatever but this has to do something with some type of scandal here and i feel like you are possibly a third party in the situation here like you are a part of this scandal and you didn't even know it yes tell us more holy spirit messages for my cancer tell us about this three of cups now tell us about the six of pentacles we're gonna go through the signs in just a minute okay tell us about the six of pentacles because I feel like some of you guys, you feel like that you were just helping, you were giving to this person. Because you could be a very generous person, you know what I'm saying? You were just trying to come to somebody's aid and help them in their time of need. But it was like this person was really a part of a scandal here. And I feel like you didn't even know about it. You were a third party who was a part of this scandal here. And this is somebody who you shared a romantic connection with. I can't make this up. This is someone who charmed you in some type of way. Like they charmed you into possibly way to you or, or or you lending them this money or you giving them this money i feel like some of you felt like you were following your heart you know what i'm saying or you were helping this person follow their dreams so this person could have been someone who came to you like with some idea or something they wanted to do and you thought you know you were just going to help this person you know follow their dreams possibly get some type of business or something off the ground but it was like really this person betrayed you this is someone who was like they scheming and scamming and this is someone who schemed and scammed you out of some money but i feel like for some of you guys <clears throat> excuse me look they trying to take my voice i feel like for some of you guys this is someone who they really were a part of some type of scandal some type of scam they had going on it was like why you were generously giving to this person trying to help you help them out it's like really you was funding this scam or this scheme or whatever this person was was doing like this is someone like they they like to to scheme and scam or this is someone who likes to make what's it that they get rich 
quick money schemes. You know what I'm saying? Like they're used to scheming and scamming. And I feel like this person schemed and scammed you out of some money as well, okay? Whew. All right. So you could be dealing with Scorpio. We got Aquarius, Libra, Scorpio, Taurus, Libra, Cancer, Leo, and Sag, okay? So let's see who else this reading is about. And I feel like with this this Knight of Cups and this Three of Cups, I feel like this is someone, like, there was a, you love this person. Like, there were feelings and emotions for this person, you know what I'm saying? And that's why you helped this person. You thought you were just giving to them, helping them out. But this is somebody who was really reckless with their money. Like, they had poor spending habits. They out here spending, you know what I'm saying, doing all type of shit with this money. All right, y'all. So we got Capricorn, Aries, Leo, Scorpio. Who is this reading about for Cancer? We got Cap Heavy Capricorn, Aries, Cancer. And we also have Scorp Heavy Scorpio, Sag, and Aquarius. All right, you guys, I love you. And until next time, stay blessed.